What up guys, it's Peacock Nation here, and today I'll be doing an unboxing and field test of my new combo. So this combo is my portable rod. It's a telescopic pole with a small reel. So to start off, we have the line. Uh, I have some Power Pro Red, yeah, it came in the right color. So it's a Power Pro 30 pound test braid. Um, I'm afraid that the 30 pound test is going to be too thick for a small reel and it's not going to cast very well, but we'll have to see that in the field test. So, here it is. So, the next box is this big box here. I'm guessing this has both the rod and the reel. Okay. So, I'm guessing this is the rod here. Um, let's see. Keep Fishing Fun Cast King. So, as you can see, it's made by Cast King. This is a Cast King Blackhawk uh, telescopic rod, and this is a the uh, 5 foot 10 version. So, the first thing you see when you get in the box is this nice, convenient travel case. Um, it's a cloth material-ish kind of thing, so um, seems to be pretty good material. Um, and the rod seems to just be loose in here, so let's see, let's take it out. Okay, so first impressions, it's actually a lot smaller than I thought, uh, which is a good thing since this is going to be my travel rod. Um, I was afraid with this long handle here it was going to be too big, but it's not that bad actually. Um, yeah, it's pretty small. I'll here, let me get a ruler. This is a standard 12-inch ruler um, next to it. So as you see, it's it's about... Yeah, it's probably about 19 inches. Um, it's pretty small. Um, I'm definitely I'm glad. So, it seems like this is made out of metal. The guides are, the guides are metal too. Uh, the handle is plastic. Um, I don't know if you can see it, but it has a nice carbon fiber finish there. It's nice. With a nice foam grip back here. And another thing that was, uh, that I found pretty interesting about this, it has this cap back here. Um, this cap actually unscrews. It's, uh, it's made, it seems to be made out of plastic. Uh, but as you see, it gives you access to the internals there. And that's good because I know people who've had problems with telescopic rods that they get dirt in it and there's no way to get it out. But this way you can just wash it out and you won't run into any problems. So it's a very good little feature given by Casking. Alright, so here we have the reel. This is a Casking Sharky 2 1500. Let's see. Okay, so it comes with a reel, some manuals, parts and stuff. Um, so let's, let's take the reel out of this packaging. Um, definitely very small. Um, so let's tighten the handle. It's actually it's very smooth. Um, let me go ahead and tighten this. So it's a very smooth reel. That's the first thing I notice. Um, the drag. Let me tighten it a little. Um, seems to be pretty smooth. Um, it's a nice reel. It's very small. Um, let's bring the ruler back. So, this is what it looks like compared to the ruler from the back end to here. It seems to be about just over four inches. So, nice compact package. Um, and actually, something that surprised me is the stats said that it was supposed to have up to 41 pounds of drag, which I think is crazy for a little reel like this. Looks good so far. 
So this is the combo here. I put the reel on. It fit great. Um, plastic seems to be holding up. So as you see here, it has a nice uh, ergonomic shape. Fits in the in the hand really well. Now to extend it. To extend it, simple. Just extend it like that. Um, it seems like the handle back here is weaved carbon fiber, and this area up here is. It seems like it's spiral carbon fiber or something like that. Um, the first thing you notice is this label here um, saying the action and stuff like that. So let's continue. Open that. Very easy. And then, so I got the 510 version, which actually looks alright. surprised at the action because the action seems quite fast for medium action um, but it's definitely it's a good looking rod and it works so can't wait to put some line on and try it out here is the outdoor test the field test of my new rod so first thing you gotta do is take off this cap um, very important that you don't lose this because this protects the smaller guides and stuff. So I'm just going to go ahead and put this in my pocket. Uh, next, I'm going to open the bale, send the line a little, and then extend it. So there it is. Seems to be in a good alignment, more or less. It's good enough for now. And see, it seems pretty flexible. So can't wait to try it. You go ahead and go put on a lure and Let's see how it casts. So I put a topwater frog here because here in it's oh. January here in Florida and they're biting topwater. So I'm gonna go ahead and try out this frog. See how it casts. See. Uh, okay, so it seems like there's a little tangle here at the tip. Let me go ahead and resolve this. All right, so we're back. We're not free. So let's try a first cast on this thing. Okay, so first cast seems like it works. It uh, it's pretty smooth. I'm actually not gonna walk it. Cause I'm just testing it right now. Let's see. So I wanted to see what this rod can really do. So I changed to a little. Uh, Rapala, little uh, hard bait. I'm not actually sure what kind it is. It's kind of old, but let's see how this casts. Eh, that's okay. Um, it's definitely not bad for a really light lure like that. Uh, 30 pound braid, and ooh, I got a little peacock bass following it. Okay, um, and a medium action rod, definitely not bad. All right, he's got a fish. All right, so I got my first fish. Nice bass. It's hard to record with this pack mount. It's okay. Who the dog is? Yeah, we got, got a bass, bass, man. Nice bass. Ooh, looks pretty big. Seems a pretty nice size. Bring him up. It's not that hard, is it? No. Ooh, that's a nice one. On a whatever beat that's called finesse or whatever. No, no, I didn't. I didn't. I still have the recall. It's a bass. It's a bass. Large mouth. Probably about a two and a half pounder. And he's off. Nice. 
Oh, uh, so what just happened is my brother got a hit and then I was reeling my line in and I got hit. So, got one. He's on. He's a little one. Sucker. Nice. All right. Got a little. Got a little bass on the telescopic rod. Second bass today. Yeah, second bass today. Look at this. Little, nice little bass. Seems pretty active, so I'll just. Yep, got him. There he goes. 